My name is Christian Parrish, Takes the Gun, a.k.a. Superman. I'm a hip-hop artist, as well as a men's fancy dancer from the Apsaloga Nation, uh, otherwise known as the Crow Nation in Montana. Kind of started just for the love of hip-hop, you know. Back in the day, we used to break dance, you know. <laughs> you know, we used to just love that culture you know, of hip-hop. And being on the res and in Montana, you know, there wasn't much hip hop, you know. So any glimpse of it on on TV or the radio, you know, we're like, hey, man, that's cool, hey, right? you know, it was exciting for us because it was new, and at the same time, being native, and what what hip hop was talking about was the same, you know, like the ghetto culture, I guess, and reservation life was kind of similar, you know. So what they were talking about, what they were rapping about, was really similar, and we could relate to it. We were performing at. Um, at a university in uh, Bozeman, Montana. And they said, yeah, we want you to come in and we want you to dance, you know, men's fancy style, powwow style. And then they said, do you guys rap too, right? And we're like, yeah, we do. And they said, well, there's gonna be a lot of youth there. You should rap too, you know, when you're when you're here. Can you do that? And it's like, yeah, we can do that. So they, they told us that. And so when we got there, we did exhibition dancing in our regalia. And then afterwards, we're like, all right, man, we'll, we'll go change and we'll come back and rap. And they're like, oh, no, there's, there's no time, you know? We need you to go on right now. And so we're like, oh, all right. And we were in our outfits. And so me and my nephew, he's a traditional dancer. We rapped, you know, in our outfits, you know, just like that. And uh, the people liked it. You know, like last night, you could just, you know, that connecting with the, the crowd, you feel that energy like that, and that just puts you on top, and it gives you that purpose as an artist, you know, like I always feel that purpose when, when I'm on stage and I'm performing, you know, for a crowd of thousands or just, you know, a handful of people, and I just feel that receptiveness and that, that power, you know, that you have of, um, this is why the creator made me, you know. I'm always open to any invitation, of seeing other cultures, especially native cultures, you know. So just the opportunity to come and experience, uh, you know, a different culture, a different native culture, and be a part of. Um, I also saw it online. I was like, man, that's a, that's cool, you know. That's a, that's a neat festival. I'd like to be a part of that. And so when when I got the invitation, I was just like, you know, let's let's do it. Let's make it happen. So.